about time you got here. I told you you were wasting your time, Del. That is why we're here. And Mathis, I am running things around here, so keep your mouth shut. You got that? <laughs> Fine. All right. Listen up, because I am only going to go through this once. We are here to dig up any info about Grix's legacy. We are not here to scrap for loot. Whatever you pick up, don't think, don't get creative, bring it straight to me. <laughs> it's so simple, even a rook like you can't screw it up. Hold on, no scrapping? How the hell am I supposed to make money around here? All right, that's enough. If either of you want to fly with the Crimson Fleet, then you need to follow one simple rule. When you're on a job, you do exactly what I say. No questions asked. If that doesn't work for you, just say so, and I will leave you on this ice ball without a ship. You will be dead within hours. Yeah, yeah. We have a lot of ground to cover between the landing area and the lock, so let's get moving. Here we are, the place where Jasper Griggs laid the groundwork for finding the legacy, and eventually, the Crimson Fleet, the lock. Yeah, he needs to get this thing open like, right now. It's freezing out here. Then crank up your suit heat, Mathis, because it's probably not going to get much better once we are inside. All right, let's keep moving. Standing out here isn't doing us any good. This ID card cost a small fortune. Let's hope it pays off.
Must be a nest. I bet these things are crawling all over the place. Yeah, and their bodies probably heard us firing from about a kilometer away. Hallelujah. If we weren't on this job with Delgado, I'd drop you for saying that. Enough already! I should have known better than to bring both of you at the same time. Now let's see. Looks like we are inside some sort of prisoner transfer area, but everything is locked down tight. Since you are such good friends, why don't you and Mathis head up to that control room and see if you can get some more of these doors open? Just great. The hell are we supposed to do now? The plan? Who gives a shit about the plan? Let's face it, we're on our own now. Well, yeah, we'll get to that eventually. For right now, I have a much better idea. We use this opportunity to take out Delgado, and at the same time, Make some serious credits for ourselves. I had a feeling you'd be on board. Okay. Here's my plan. Let's pretend for a second Delgado's correct. And there's information here about Crix's legacy. Once we get rid of him, we'll dig up the garbage ourselves and sell whatever we find to Neva. We'll be rolling in credits. Playing it safe, huh? I can respect that. But you better have me back when I make me move. Now, let's find a way out of here. I guess that's one way. Okay, Zouch. What the hell was so important that you had to drag me all the way out of A Block at this hour? You know Jasper Crick's over in D Block? He's busting out of here, and he wants me to join him. Crix really thinks he can bust out of the lock? Why the hell am I just hearing about it now? Crix only told the few you people he trusts. To come up there we told us to keep to ourselves. We'll cut our throats. Then why the hell are you... So the two of you made it, huh? Don't worry. It all goes downhill from here. <laughs> now listen up. We have obviously been cut off, so I need you to do two things. First... I want you to keep looking for a way to open the rest of the doors down here. Otherwise, I'm not going anywhere. And second, try and dig up whatever you can about Jasper Griggs. You both got that? Yeah? You'd better. And tell Mathis not to get any bright ideas, or I will gut him myself.
So have you thought about what I've said? Well, maybe we won't have to. You saw it back there. Those things, whatever they were, they've probably ripped him to shreds by now. Did the job for us. And if they haven't, we can still handle the job. We just have to get our hands a little dirty. Wouldn't be the first time, am I right? You've got a point. All right, I'll follow your lead for now. So, now that we've made it to the guard tower, what's our next move, genius? Been in a few slams yourself, I see. Okay, I'll follow your lead. D03118. Okay. It's a place to start, I guess.
Was this an armory? Looks like they cleared this place out. Well, well, what do we have here? Uh, give me a sec. This sort of come in handy. like this was the warden's office. They built the office right in the Hey, what the hell? This is bullshit, Delgado. I help plenty. Is that Mathis? 
Tell him to shut up. I will deal with him later. Whatever. Okay. Now all we have to do is find a way off of this planet. Um, let me see. Ah, here we go. I'm looking at schematics for the lock. And I don't think there's a way to get you back to the surface from there. But I can open the outer doors to the shuttle bay and let you fly one of the shuttles down there directly up to the key. Good answer. You're learning fast. Okay. Let me see. One of these probably opens the door. Shuttle bay activated. Initiating the icing process. Please stand by. Yup. That's got it. Might take a while, though. Those bay doors have not been opened in almost a century. You have done a hell of a job, Rook. We will talk when you get back to the key. Why the hell did you lie to Delgado about me? You didn't do all this work alone. Oh, come on. There's no need for that. You're right. Maybe I could have done more of the brain work. But hey, at least I helped you take out those things, whatever the hell they were. Right? Look, um... About all that killing Delgado stuff, why don't we just forget about everything that I said? You know, like it never happened. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I promise that you won't regret it. Now, let's get the heck out of here.
There you are. The hell took you so long? It's about time. I was about to fly down and loot your bodies. Not now, neighbor. Well, you said you found something. Hand it over. That's it? Just one slate. After losing so much of our crew, it better be a map with a big red X on it. Well, I'll be damned. Legacy wasn't referring to Crix's fortune. It's the name of an actual ship. A Galbank transport probably loaded with credits. Never heard any stories about a Galbank ship going down. And even if it had happened, it would have been picked clean years ago. No, neighbor. Think. If Galbank covered it up, and over time, the location was eventually forgotten, it wouldn't be on anyone's radar. Okay. This changes things. Now that we know what we are looking for, we have to narrow the search. And the recording that you found proves that it is out there. All we have to do is find it. Let us start with what we know. It was a Galbank ship, which means the company is going to have records of where it went down. Neva, weren't you working on a deal with Rocco? Something about a big wig charity event on one of Friday's starliners? Are you serious? I've been working on that gig for three months. That's my score. Adios mio. Will you shut up about your score and think for a second? That Starliner has a Galbank VIP suite aboard. Which means... Come on, Ava. This isn't hard. Which means a Galbank exec will be aboard. We grab their credentials and get ourselves into the Galbank archives in New Atlantis. Holy shit, that might actually work. I'll send a message to Rokov right away. Pack your bags, Rook. You're going on vacation. And since you've earned it, take this gun with you. Might come in handy when Rokov screws everything up as usual. Good. Because that is exactly what you are going to be doing. Neighbor and I are too well known to walk around the Starliner without being recognized. If Trident Security spotted us, it'd be over. I need you to board that ship, make contact with Rokov, and get me those credentials. You'd better. Oh, before you leave, I wanted you to know that I took what you said about Mathis into consideration, and I've decided to cut him from the fleet. Honestly, I'm surprised he made it off Suvorov in one piece. <laughs> Fair enough. That's it then. Next stop for you is Rokov Starliner, the Siren of the Stars. And remember, Rokov does not need to know anything about Grix's legacy. For now, it's just between us. Now get out of here. Hey, Rook, before you head out, I need to have a word with you. Meet me at the last Nova after you wrap things up with Matthew. If you have any last questions about the job, ask them now. Need a drink? Bug at the Last Nova will be more than happy to take care of you. Hey, I want to talk to you. Thanks to you, Delgado's cutting me from the fleet. Well, you know what? You better get your own fleet, because I'm coming after you. Oh, I will, I can promise you that. Best part is, you won't even see it coming. Now get the hell out of me way! Need. There you are. All right, look. 
I've been lining up a score with that asshole roll call from the Siren of the Stars for months. I'm not about to let a payday slip through my fingers. So guess what? You're gonna finish the job for me. Seems of course you'll get a cut. That's how everything works around here. Why would this be any different? Wokov's been tipping me off about some kind of bullshit charity event that the Siren of the Stars is hosting. At the event, they're gonna give away something called the Earth Savior Award, which is worth tens of thousands of credits. So it's simple. While you're on the Siren, swiping those Galbait credentials, I want you to grab that award and bring it to me. Yeah, yeah, very funny. You're hilarious. You should stand up on the bar here and start telling more jokes. This crowd would eat it up. Look, you can make all the jokes and excuses you want. But if you don't come back with the ES award, I'm gonna deduct it from your pay. Either way, I get my money. How much you walk away with is in your own hands. Got it? Then it's settled. Good. All right, Rook, we're done here. Now, get your ass to the siren and bring me my goods. Stay sharp, Rook. all across the galaxy. Heard you boarded the key. Yo, back. So how did it go? Then things are moving forward. Perfect. Nice job, Rook. I was certain we'd fool Delgado, but never. She's a sharp one. Overcoming her scrutiny is no small matter. Did you discover anything worth reporting yet? Legacy. Why does that sound familiar? Wait a moment. Are you telling me Delgado may have actually located Crix's legacy? I suppose it's possible, sir. Intelligence picked up a bit of chatter on that subject recently. We assumed it was some sort of tall tale or a story to attract recruits to their cause. Well, let's find out if Delgado is chasing ghosts. Or he's smarter than we suspect. Let me see what we have here. Nope. There are no records of a gal bank transport named the legacy in the database. <laughs> I think Delgado's trying to manipulate you. What do you think, sir? I think there's no record because gal bank is hiding something. Delgado's no fool. If he risked his own neck to get that information, then he must be on to something. We have to take this seriously. What's your next move? Clever, Delgado. Very clever. If I were in your place, I'd be trying to do the exact same thing. We can't let Delgado get his hands on what could potentially turn out to be the largest haul of credits the Crimson Fleet's ever seen. Maybe I should head out to New Atlantis, sir. I could press the Galbank execs for information. Get ahead of everything. No. Let's allow this to run its course. We have our agent here feeding us information. I think that's good enough for now. There's more to this than just finding the location of the transport. Jasper Crix was clever. And for some reason, he never got there. It's imperative that you do. If the Crimson Fleet gets its hands on a transport full of currency, it would be disastrous for the settled systems. I need you to do whatever you can to bring us more information. And for God's sake, don't kill anyone on that Starliner. You're both dismissed. <laughs> 